My name is Mike Sullivan. I'm a former IRS agent and teaching instructor. Welcome to my YouTube video. This is the home of the five minute or less video. Um, I worked for IRS, like I said, 10 years. I've been in private practice for 40 years. Next year, I've been doing this for, yep, 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 uh, 50 years. I have a whole team of former IRS agents. I'm a national expert in IRS resolution matters. Um, I have been on the news, God, 10 times, uh, five times actually in the last um, three months on different issues that news stations call me on. I started this YouTube station um, when I was just browsing just by mistake and I seen a lot of the people, um, advertise or whatever they do on YouTube. It was really scary some of the stuff they were telling you. There's some good people but I will tell you <coughs> just a little bit of the flu bug. About 60% um, about of the people in this space they should never be involved in any sort of IRS tax representation. Uh, the bigger companies are really um, you got to be worried of those. How do you know what a big company is? You'll see them on Google and they'll say add, 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 add and the bottom add, add, add. Um, that means that they're spending a lot of money on salespeople and they're spending a lot of money on advertising. So you're better off just finding somebody not in that space, someone who's experienced and been doing this a long time. What I want to talk to you today about is just the inf piece of information. Um, by the way, as a former uh, agent, I was a revenue officer. I used to work the offer and compromise program. I used to instruct people, or I used to accept and deny offers. I was good enough that they sent me to Atlanta to teach the offer program, so I am an expert in the IRS offer and compromise program. Uh, just to let you know, there's some really good news. If you go ahead and get your offer and compromise accepted, IRS releases the lien after you meet the terms of the offer and compromise. So I just wanted to make you aware of that, that um, good news. So an IRS offer takes about a year right now to get filed, I mean accepted. And if it's accepted and you meet the terms, the payment terms, that federal tax lien comes off, I want you to be aware of something. You must file and pay your taxes the next five years. If not, your case comes right back to the field as though you never had an offer accepted. So if your offer and compromise was accepted, Make sure you read the back of the form and keep the terms of the offer for the next five years. File timely, pay timely, but your IRS federal tax lien will get released. Can they uh, uh, file it again? Yes, if you do not meet the terms of the offer and pay for the next five years, your federal tax lien will go back on you. You have any questions, give me a call. We do all sorts of representation. Give me a subscription if you would. That really helps me. Leave me a comment, give me a question. Tell me if you want me to do a YouTube for something. Anyway, thank you for the subscription. I appreciate you.